boxing workout today. Cardio boxing. Okay, we call it fit, fitness kit boxing. A lot of women will tell me I don't really get a lot out of, even if I have my equipment out, um, you know, with the boxing, boxing gloves and the mitts, it's because you're not putting enough effort into it. If you put enough effort into this, you're going to get a workout. Okay, we've got seven exercises. No body, no dumbbells. Okay, just your own body weight. We're going to start out. Right foot forward, right arm forward. Are you ready? 45 seconds of work. 15 seconds of rest. And we're just going to jab it out. It's going to be way harder than you think to do this tight. Abs tight. My right arm, my, my right foot forward, so is my right arm. You see that? So jab, cross. That's what it's called. I'm just going fast. I'm doing cardio today. I'm not really worried about um, my technique, so to speak. Okay, I'm just trying to get my intensity levels up. That's all I'm doing. Push it hard. Push it hard. Are your arms going as fast as mine? Bring it back to the chin. Abs tight. My, my knees are slightly bent. You want to stand like this. Okay? Take it. Trust me, this is harder than what you think if you're really going at it. Okay? Four, three, two. Left foot forward, left arm forward. This is called a jab, this is a cross. But because I'm working harder, I'm not going to really pivot the back foot, if you notice. Woo! Okay, here we go. Ready? Go. Whoops. Knock myself there. Push hard. As you can see, my left arm is not as strong. You can tell by the way I'm punching. My brain is trying to tell my muscles what to do. And because I'm not left sided here, it's going a whole lot slower. I don't have the power. But you still got to do what you do on the right, you got to do on the left in fitness. Anything to do with fitness. Always keeping the sides of the body balanced. That's what it comes down to. 10 seconds. Go, go, go. Hard. 10, 9, 8. Push hard. 7, 6, 5, 4. Come on. Just about there. Your arms should feel sore from this tomorrow, by the way. Uh, what do we do next? Weave and bob. Okay, so I'll just follow me. We're going to be doing this. Okay, that's it. You'll see it in four, three, two, one. Abs tight. Here we go. So duck, notice how I'm ducking down, coming up, ducking down, coming up. Boom, boom. So if I was in the ring, abs tight. Okay, butt tight. So if I was in the ring, where would I use this? Somebody's trying to punch me, boom, boom. I would get away from him, okay, or her. That's what this is used for. Now, if I punch more to the side, boom, I can do that. Make it harder, boom, for my obliques to work. Okay, push it hard. Arms hard, I don't want to see this. Okay, that will do nothing. The strength comes from your core, and then it comes through out through your arms, that's how boxing works. Okay. Uh, reverse lunges. Start with your right foot. Your right foot's going to come back. Okay? Just like that. Go watch me. Right foot. We're going to stay on our right foot. Lunge. Kick. Lunge. Kick. So now, if you saw this before, I was putting my arms like this. One of the workouts. You'll see me doing this. Today, I'm going to have them up by my chin. So what do you think is going to happen? My balance is off because I'm not having my arms to balance, see? So here, I'm protecting my face like if I was in a boxing match. Always protecting your face. But now, this really works my balance because I don't have that to stabilize my arms. Okay? Always getting to lunch, kicking, lunch kicking. Rest. What do you think we're going to do? Left foot comes back. You tell I'm working hard because my breathing's coming up. When your breathing's coming up, it means you're burning fat. Here we go. Take it back. Kick. Back. Kick. Hands by the chin, protecting the face. Okay? You may be kicking lower. You may be kicking higher. It all depends on the strength, joint mobility in the hip, hamstrings, flexibility. Just about there. What do we got? 15 seconds. Push hard. 
So do you think I'm working balance here? Yes. Am I working coordination? A little bit. All right, so it's always good to work different facets into your workout. Just about there, by the way. Ooh. Speed bag. So legs wide, toes out like a sumo or plie squat. Get down, arms here. We're gonna go like this as fast as we can and lift up the heels. Do not hit yourself in the chin. I've done it and it doesn't tickle. Notice how my, they're not down here, they're up. See, look at my arms. They're getting a workout. You, trust me, you'll feel it. Now go the other way. <laughs> Your brain is like, what? Go the other way, quick, quick, quick. So I want to see this. So I can tell that you haven't done it before if I see this. It just helps with your brain. It just tries to get used to it as you go. And I'm staying in that static position. Don't be doing this. You gotta get down. My heels are coming up. So I'm in that isometric contraction, which is making my legs and abs work. But my arms are working. Heavy breathing. So you know what that means. All right. This is the last one. Get on a mat or on the carpet at your house. Crunch, punch, crunch, punch, boom, boom. Now you're gonna go the other side, boom. Now you're gonna go this side, boom. Now I'll go this other side. Now I'll go the other side. So your chin should not move. That's where it should be, okay? So I gotta think, I stop, think, stop, think. Because if I don't, I'll continue to do this. And I'll only work that one side. That, that's what will happen. Believe me, stop, think. Just about there. Stretch it out. That was a boxing, boxing circuit. No equipment needed. We'll see you later. Bye.